And that is a liquid nitrogen explosion, guys. Hey guys, welcome back to Incredible Science. I am pumped today because today I did a video that I've been working on literally for the last five years. I've been trying to think, how can I do this video? Is it possible? Can I get the resources? Can I get the place to do it? And today, everything fell into place and I was so excited that it worked. It came out amazing. I can't wait for you to see it. The video I'm talking about, as you can tell from the thumbnail, exploding a thousand ping pong balls using liquid nitrogen. Now, I'm not talking about breaking the balls apart although some did break apart. I'm talking about launching a thousand ping pong balls out of a garbage can using liquid nitrogen. Now I've never seen anyone do it with rainbow balls that I've done today. This came out amazing and I am so excited to show you. Now I tested it last night just to make sure that it would work. So I took a small amount of ping pong balls, a small amount of liquid nitrogen, and the result was still really explosive. So here's a clip of me yesterday testing it out to make sure that it would all go as planned. I did it on a smaller scale, and here's what happened. Before we continue guys, yes, it's another giveaway, another Stay Incredible Pop Socket and Fidget Spinner. Pop Socket, by the way, in case you don't know, it's something you put on the back of your phone, you pop it out, you can use it as a stand, like that, or as a selfie stick, or just something to fidget with. This is what I used as a fidget spinner before I had a fidget spinner. Anyway, I want to say thank you to you guys for being so awesome, for being subscribed to my channel. So, I'm giving this away to the first person that can comment on when I say the secret word of the day. The secret word of the day is giant. When you hear me say that word, be the first person to comment below the exact time that I say it and I will send this to you. Simple as that, easy, just be the first person to find the right time when I say it. All right, now moving on. All right guys, here we are. This is the gym where I'm going to attempt to do the giant ping pong ball liquid nitrogen explosion. I'm gonna set it up right in the middle, and everything is here. Bucket full, garbage can full of colorful ping pong balls. Let's get it going. All right, we are here in the gym with the liquid nitrogen and the garbage can and the thousands of ping pong balls, which we are gonna explode. All right, let's set it up and hope it goes. I'm about to fill up this garbage can with Ping pong balls. Now there are a lot of ping pong balls already in here. I'm gonna fill it up with liquid nitrogen until about here. Then I'm gonna put it in. And then I'm gonna quickly dump out the rest of the ping pong balls into there. But before I do that, I'm gonna cap off the bottle. I'm gonna put a cap on it. And the pressure is gonna build. It could take a minute or two or longer. I don't know. Last night when I tried it with a small bottle, it took two minutes. So the anticipation is gonna build. You don't wanna look away, even if it's gonna take a while, and then all of a sudden you'll hear a boom, and like one or two ping pong balls may come out. Maybe three or four. But I'm more nervous that it's not gonna explode at all. And then we're just gonna be waiting, and it's gonna be too dangerous to get up to get over there. We'll it's stuck in the gym forever. So I put the bottle in, as you see, I'm waiting and I'm waiting, and nothing is happening. This was my biggest fear of this experiment because it's a really powerful 
bomb in there. It's a liquid nitrogen bomb. You can't just go in and take it with your hand or look over and see what's going on. It could really hurt you. And this is what I was afraid of. It wouldn't explode and how do I get it out? So that's what happened. We were, this was about seven minutes of nothing happening. So what I did was, well, here's what happened. Okay, so at least we... Okay, it's pretty empty. So yeah, it turns out the bottle wasn't sealed that well and it was leaking out so it didn't have a chance to build up the pressure and explode. But I reset and I did it again and it worked incredibly well. Just watch the giant explosion. There's a lot in here, it should work. That's really tight. This will work. And that is the liquid nitrogen explosion, guys. That was awesome. Woo! Finally worked. It is done. I was honestly afraid to do it because it's a big explosion. I didn't have a place to do it, so so happy that it worked out. Give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it. That was a lot of ping pong balls. Now I'm gonna go clean this up. And thanks for helping clean up, Z. It felt so good to finally be able to do it. But I still have one more ping pong thing to show you, a cool ping pong liquid nitrogen experiment. And that is how to get a ping pong to spin like 5,000 RPM. Now, the way you do it is you put a little hole in the ping pong, not straight down, but it had an angle. The dunk it in liquid nitrogen, and then when you touch it or you just let it warm up, it's just spinning like crazy because the liquid nitrogen is shooting out the hole. Spinning like crazy. Woo. Check it out. Can you see it? That was awesome. And guys, we're gonna end it off with a little liquid nitrogen. Fun. And that's it for today, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. Comment below, show me the love, give this video a like. I never really do like goals, but since we have so many awesome subscribers here, let's see if we can get 6,000 likes on this video. I know it's asking a lot, but let's just see if we could do it. You guys would surprise me. It would be amazing if we could get 6,000 likes. That would tell me that you guys are really here, are really responding to me, and it, it would just be cool to know that we have that connection. So hit that like button, subscribe if you haven't, Go check out my vlog channel, Incredible Science Vlogs. And thank you so much for watching, guys. Remember, new video tomorrow, 4 p.m., new giveaway tomorrow, 4 p.m. And that's it for today. 
Stay incredible, guys. Thanks. I will see you tomorrow. Peace. And that is the liquid nitrogen explosion, guys.